We've got another exciting mission to ancient Greece today. Not to see Dio again, but rather to see the first ever woman to win in the Olympic Games. Her name was Siniska, Princess of Sparta. So without further ado, let's go! my tea. I am so sorry. I I'm uh, Special Agent L. I've come from the future to learn about how the great Siniska won gold at the Olympic Games. Ah, yes. Come sit. My journey to the great Olympic Games started when I was just a little girl. I loved riding horses. I was the fastest equestrian in my whole town. Ever since I could remember, my dream was to compete in the chariot race at the Olympics. But when I was finally old enough to enter, I was denied admission because only men were allowed to compete in the Olympic Games. What? So you weren't able to compete like you always wanted to? Oh, ye of little faith. I was determined. I found a way to adapt. Doing some research, I learned that the owner of the horses is the one who gets the medal for winning, not the charioteer. So I put all of my energy into training my horses for the Olympic chariot race and I hired a man to drive them during the actual competition. Whoa! That's genius! How did you do? Not bad, not bad. I got gold. I have a gold-worthy idea, travelers. Old Dio told me to practice making levers and fulcrums last time. In the honor of all the women who can now participate in the Olympic Games, I challenge you to design some games. You can create any kind of game as long as it uses at least one lever. When you finish your game, test it out. Challenge yourself. Challenge your friend. Challenge your teacher. 